High Bay Pines exposed and concerned Americans. The question we need to ask is what's wrong with Bay Pines VA Hospital in St. Petersburg, Florida? You've got one officer that refers to veterans as douchebags, merry band of misfits, having mental issues, bunch of little bitches, amusing. Then you've got his boss, the assistant police chief, his repeated sexual harassment and bad behavior has cost taxpayers over $1.3 million in lawsuit settlements that can be verified through court documents. Also, one of the veterans that he repeatedly sexually harassed, her husband committed suicide. He was a 37-year-old Air Force veteran. VA claims zero tolerance for sexual harassment, but this guy still has his job years later. And this is director, former director Suzanne Klinker. She was the one at the helm of this disaster all through most of its problems. When she started getting exposed and started getting negative media coverage, what did the VA do? Fire? Oh, hell no. They promoted her. Fortunately, the new director at this facility seems to be headed in the right direction to try and clean some of this up. He has been very responsive in concerns we brought to his attention and has done more positive things in the last two months that he's been here than she did in the six years she was director here. Only time will tell if the new director is going to follow through and clean this place up. We shall see. I certainly hope so.